Well, I know you can look it up that the royal family is obsessed with it. I mean, they're not stupid. And look at their health. They're really quite in good health. They also do homeopathy, too. And then they have people making fun of that and misrepresenting it constantly. It's, it's, it's just incredible. Wow. Well, well, tell us about your website. Tell us about where this is going. I know you're trying to get more attention to this. And I know that some of the presidents over in Africa are obviously one for themselves and their families. Uh, I don't think they're going to be able to hide something this powerful, Doctor. Uh, well, first of all, I, I've posted our story on my, on my Facebook page. There's a public page. Anybody can go to it, Dr. Robert J. Rowan. So you can go there and read my postings. I have an incredible YouTube channel with well over 100 patients, and many of them before and after treatments. Some of them crippled when they walked in the door, and they're dancing out, swinging their hips afterwards. That YouTube channel is youtube.com slash user slash Robert Rowan, MD, R-O-W-E-N is my name. Uh, you can find that easy. Uh, there's a lot of videos of me on YouTube, but you want to go to the channel to see the patients. And I even have patients that we, re doctors from Sierra Leone that we recorded both before and after. And you need to look at the expression on their face. You'll see things you just wouldn't believe if you didn't see it. And by the way, the day after the government shut down our attempt to use ozone on Ebola patients there, the foreign minister called my physician host who was trying to get this through and he wanted ozone treatment for his mother and his family because she was in an Ebola area. Isn't that interesting? So they'll shut it down for everybody, but they still want it for themselves. Well, look, I'll be honest, I've been hearing about this ozone injections and these treatments they do, taking the blood out, there's other systems for years, but now it is all the rage. And I've seen people I know that are like 65 years old that are already, one of them's a well-known sports champion that I'm friends with, and he just looks so much younger from the ozone treatments, and it's amazing. I think I'm going to do it. Uh, but I'll probably consult with you, doctor, about where I should go and what the best treatment would be, because I know you're one of the grand poobahs of it. Uh, I hope you can come back in the next few weeks for a full hour uh, to really you know, send us the points you want to go over, play some clips of your videos, and do a special hour uh, on this, because alternative medicine that's been proven uh, to be so effective is, is, is just a gift that you and others are helping promote out to the world, so we salute uh, what you're doing but it's so simple we operate off oxygen so supercharged <laughs> oxygen with ozone uh, just does amazing things inside the body and and i've also read from the scientists the mainline literature that oxygen levels are low uh, in the planet's history right now as well correct yeah, actually, our oxygen levels are probably getting lower as we're destroying more of the plant life that create that that, that puts oxygen out. Sure, yeah. But the most important thing to your body above everything is oxygen. And it's a long way from oxygen out here to oxygen in the tip of your finger inside the circuit in, inside your body. It's a long route. And ozone is incredible at helping that process out. Oxygen is the fundamental of life for us. And all healing is dependent upon oxygen. No kidding. You don't have it, you die. Okay, well, promise you'll come back for a full hour, Dr. Robert Rowan, MD, drrowanmd.com, docrowan.com. We're going to tweet again the link out to your YouTube page. Uh, just amazing information. Thank you for spending time with us, and good job uh, to Nico Acosta for getting you on. Thank you so much, Alex. One final question I forgot to ask before we go. So just to be clear, I saw it in the news. You're there. The doctors are loving it. And then they ban the treatment in the country. And, and I mean, that's just amazing. The doctors loved it. It was the Ministry of Health that, that axed it. And it, this is just an opinion now. It's, it's my personal opinion. I believe they're more interested in getting the millions and millions of dollars coming in to, to, to dig graves and to incinerate the bodies than they are in trying something that has been proven safe to actually save the life. We wanted to put the grave diggers out of business not get more money in for grave digging. All right. Well, God bless you. It makes a lot of sense. We need oxygen. <laughs> wow. What a thought. Thank you, doctor. Thank you. Next, we're going to say that divers underwater need it. That's why they call us conspiracy theorists. Uh, before we go back uh, to break and come back with this amazing piece Rob Dew put together, uh, oxy powder. They tried to get me on this for two years. It's another special form of oxygen. Uh, this is all you know, patented, certified proprietary by Dr. Group. He's had it for more than a decade out. I finally took it. 
Rob Dew lost 12 pounds in one week of matter inside of him. It does it painlessly, effortlessly, for me especially, just it all comes out of there. All that extra waste that's in there. And you take five to seven pills a day for a week for a cleanse. I only use about a third of the bottle, myself and Dew. And it's just simply amazing. Oxy Powder from Global Healing Center, available discounted exclusively, to, uh, th that discount, to InfoWarsLife.com visitors. You can get the Survival Shield X2 and all the other amazing products at InfoWarsLife.com. We're only running this special till next week because Survival Shield's about to sell out. 10% off Survival Shield, and I'm still keeping the special. When you get it as part of the biodefense pack with lung cleanse for 10% uh, you know, off InfoWarsLife.com. Or until it sells out. It may be sooner than next week. Then we'll just have the regular survival shield, nation iodine, until we get more in. And we're selling out of DNA Force. I want to thank you all for your support. You helped fund the Info War, but these really are revolutionary products. But find out more about oxygen in your gut, Oxy Powder, uh, revolutionary, changed my life, InfoWarsLife.com. We'll be back with the Rob New Special. This hour of GCN programming is proudly sponsored by BlockItPocket.com. Protect your privacy and data and render your phone or device completely undetectable. Go under the radar when your phone's not in use with BlockItPocket.com. Hi, Ted Anderson with Midas Resources. Is it time to convert paper 401ks and IRAs to solid gold and silver yet? Get our 10 Reasons book free. Call 800-686-2237. That's 800-686-2237. Are you ready to surrender your right to buy body armor? No joke. Congress is now trying to outlaw civilian body armor. And if House Bill H.R. 5344 becomes law, you can kiss your right to protect yourself against rifle bullets goodbye. Don't put off your body armor purchase any longer. Go now to InfidelBodyArmor.com. Thousands of military veterans trust their lives to Infidel Body Armor. You should too. Spelled I-N-F-I-D-E-L. Infidel Body Armor. Just won't quit. Aging starts at the cellular level. When cells become toxic, they die early and aging sets in. In the past decade, we have witnessed unparalleled scientific discoveries. During that period, key patented compounds have focused on mitochondrial growth, nerve growth, and rejuvenation. But no one has put together a formula that focuses directly on brain health, nerve growth factors, and optimizing your cellular energy at the same time. We now have the synergistic solution, D DNA Force, just one of the key compounds. BioPQQ is backed by major clinical studies and over 175 PubMed listed published studies. You want the best that's out there at the lowest price anywhere? The ultimate value, cutting edge, trailblazing game changer that also supports the InfoWar. Secure your DNA Force today at InfoWarsLife.com or call toll free 888-253-3139. DNA Force from InfoWars Life. Americans, you are being lied to. Does your skin crawl when a politician or a stock market guru say that we are in the midst of an economic recovery? According to top insiders, the largest financial meltdown in history is coming. You can prepare, but if you're living paycheck to paycheck, how do you find the cash? If you're fortunate enough to have retirement savings, it's probably not enough. And if it's in the market, it could be wiped out just like the last crash. But this time, it will almost certainly be much worse. Precious metals are a great hedge, but they won't generate immediate cash flow to pay the bills. Learn the secret to creating cash flow and freedom. Get a free copy of my special report at babyboomerbackupplan.com or call 800-704-4117. That's 800-704-4117 or visit babyboomerbackupplan.com. Traditional retirement may not be in the cards, but re-inspirement can change everything. Babyboomerbackupplan.com. Well, I could stand in line for this. Rob Dew's sneak peek at Star Wars, The Force Awakens by Disney. You know it's going to be cheesy. In case you're wondering, the new title for Star Wars Episode 7 was just released, and it's going to be called The Force Awakens. Interesting title. And we'll see if that still plays out. In the past, there have been title changes at the last minute. Return of the Jedi was going to be called Revenge of the Jedi. And now we all hope that J.J. Abrams can succeed where the prequel failed. And that's to create a movie with credible acting and not rely on cartoon characters to appeal to that elusive two to six-year-old demographic. 
What's this? A local. But where the prequel did go right is by illustrating the false flag operation and the Hegelian dialectic. In order to ensure the security and continuing stability, the Republic will be reorganized into the first galactic empire for a safe and secure society. Emperor Palpatine, or the emperors he is referred to by the time he was thrown down a reactor shaft, started off as a mild-mannered senator from Naboo. He then hatched a multi-decade plan using many different alien races as his useful ID-10Ts. That's idiots for all you out there who don't speak nerd. These aren't the droids you're looking for. These aren't the droids we're looking for. He secretly initiates the creation of two armies, manages to get elected chancellor under the guise of a humanitarian crisis. My first act with this new authority, I will create a grand army of the Republic to counter the increasing threats of the separatists. Then starts a war where both sides of the conflict have unlimited budgets to fight a war on hundreds of battlefronts, thereby draining the resources of all sides, and doing this under the nose of the Jedi, who just can't seem to realize that the guy walking and talking with them is a Sith Lord. Mm, the dark side clouds everything. The Emperor even manages to off all of his commanders and convinces his new apprentice, Darth Bad Acting, to kill all the remaining leaders of his confederacy, so he is then the only person with total knowledge of his master plan. He will take care of you. Lord Sidious promised us peace. He only wants... Look up the Night of the Long Knives if you want a historical example for that one. Fast forward 18 years, the Supreme Chancellor disbands his dysfunctional government in favor of a dictatorship I have just received word that the Emperor has dissolved the Council permanently. Thus completing a galaxy-wide false flag which started off as a seemingly small planetary trade blockade on his home planet. So by playing off all sides against each other and creating a crisis, which is the Confederacy with a giant drone army, he is able to pull off the Hegelian dialectic by providing his own convenient clone army which he started creating years ago. Emperor Palpatine is the perfect technocrat dictator. It's treason, then. So while it remains to be seen out there what will be seen in Episode 7, whether it's Chrome Stormtroopers, the Inquisitor, or Chewbacca with a bionic hand, it will be interesting to see if J.J. Abrams can harness the archetypes and historical references that George Lucas used all so well. The fact that he is now under the Disney umbrella probably means anything meaningful won't be seen in this film. There will be a lot of flash and a lot of lens flares. That I can almost assure you. I find your lack of faith disturbing. But I do have a new hope that he will do a better job than George Lucas in creating a stylistic masterpiece. And if you would like a complete history of false flags, pick up a copy of Terror Storm, a history of government-sponsored terrorism at the InfoWars store, or you can watch it free on YouTube. Please write in the comments below which in your mind is the biggest false flag that we've seen since 1977, which is the year Star Wars premiered. This has been Rob Dew with Infowars.com, and may the Force be with you. Well done, Lord Dew. <laughs> That's it for this transmission. Great job, folks. See you Sunday. Help me, I'm weak. You are listening to GCN. Visit GCNlive.com today. InfoWarsLife.com. Check it out today. I have set out to bring you the most hardcore, cutting-edge supplements and nutraceuticals bar none. And that's what you'll find at InfoWarsLife.com. We have rejected literally hundreds of products from the InfoWars Life line because they are not of the very highest quality or because they're not 100% organic or because they don't pass all of the strictest toxicology tests there are that we have listed at InfoWarsLife.com. Whether it's Survival Shield Nascent Iodine or DNA Force, Super Melvin Vitality, super female vitality, lung cleanse, fluoride shields, oxy powder. I believe that all of these products will blow you away like they've done the thousands of other customers that have visited InfoWarsLife.com and believed in us and tried the products. Folks, check out InfoWarsLife.com today and the entire line of groundbreaking, cutting-edge, hardcore products.